Monsanto, John and Beverly Anderson, Junkie Ford, Chrysler, Jeep and Dodge in Center Point, the City of Benton, and uh, other sponsors is Raleigh Equipment, Marlon Duncan, Cobblestone Inn and Suites, New Century Farm Service, Kenny's Barbershop, Syngenta, Vincent Corkery, Pouser Energy Resources, and Celebrity Heating and Air Conditioning. Smokes go outside. Gentlemen, tonight our president of our Iowa Pyrotechnic Association is here to welcome us. Charles Yedlick from Vinton here is here to give us to welcome all of us. I'd like to welcome everybody on behalf of the IPA to the fifth in town event, which Tom said is presented by Green Trade Union. Very happy to serve this community. Uh, this community was torn apart by the floods of 08 and the winds of 2011. Each time this community comes bouncing back, the reason for this is the volunteers that live in this community or surrounding communities that step forward and make something happen to get for this community. You all know who you are. He's done. There's too many to name them. But we do show our appreciation by a big round of applause for the volunteers that keep this community going. <laughs> this event was created by volunteers. The donations that you give is what makes it grow. The IPA does not do this for a profit. We do this as a way of sharing our talents with you as you share your community with us. We thank you for giving us this opportunity to display our talents to you and a sincere thank you to all the sponsors of tonight's event. Without you, this would not happen. Tonight, we'll begin with a display of shells and rockets built by IPA members. We are hobbyists and we cherish the freedom that allows us to display our talent for you to enjoy. Please sit back, if you can, and enjoy the show. Ladies and gentlemen, next, let's hear for our president. There's tirelessly as a lot of volunteers do to make this thing happen. Hours, days, weeks. Once in your own process, we're glad you're here. I'd like to now to uh, give you Scott Anderson, our former president of the IPA. He has a few words to say. Good evening, Benton, and welcome to all. As the past president of the Iowa Pyrotechnic Association and a current member, I want to recognize a club that likes its members. Be careful now. For those of you that are in the IBA or know someone that is you, that you would know these words to be fun, 
family, fireworks, and most importantly, freedom. Fireworks and the IPA are taken seriously, but we do not take them for granted, nor our freedom to possess and display them. Tonight, we wish to thank those that have served, are serving to defend our freedoms, and many have paid the ultimate price prior to and since 9-11-2001. They will never be forgotten. This being only a few weeks before the 10th anniversary of 9-11, the IPA is dedicating this show to our military. They are the backbone of this wonderful country, and I thank you to all our armed services. We are honored to have as guests here this evening, and they are in arrival, several members of the United States Thunderbird team. They are performing at the Waterloo Airport. They are aces at what they do. After we have heated things up and dazzled you with what a pyro does best, head up to Waterloo on Sunday to top off this fun-filled and thrilling weekend with the show on the sky, Thunderbird style. Thank you to all our sponsors, Meridian, and the rest of the sponsors and you the spectator. Remember, the only thanks a pyro needs is to hear thunder in the crowd. So please do not hold back your oohs and your odds if it is what you like to see. You may find you like our efforts and also want to become a member. Hope you enjoy this fun-filled fireworks display this evening with you, family, and thank our armed forces for the freedom to do so. God bless America. And I'd like to present Dan Higgins. Uh, second Vice President, Fire Technical Skill there now. Hi folks, it's really good to see uh, a great crowd of fireworks lovers out there, and thank you very much for showing up tonight. Uh, I belong to the Board of Directors of the Fire Technical Skill International. It's uh, an international organization about pyrotechnics, by golly. There's five people on the board, a president, three vice presidents, and a second vice president. And I'm second best vice president, Dan Craig. I'm the best of what club. Okay, that joke didn't go over well this afternoon either. <laughs> so, uh, I really want to thank everybody for coming again, and if you have a chance, go to the web, go to pgi.org, and see what we have to offer. We are also a very large pyrotechnics group, and uh, we're going to be in LaPorte, Indiana, first week of August 2012. It will be a huge event. We owe a debt of thanks to people in the IPA for supporting the PGI, and I'm coming here to say they have done a fantastic job. Thanks a lot, IPA. Thank you. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, we're proud to have the Marine Corps and the Marine Corps League uh, present the flag and raise the flag tonight. Please rise, remove your cover, please. And we're going to remain standing, please, until the flag is retired. We're going to retire the flag tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Cedar Valley Detachment of the Marine Corps League it's based in Cedar Rapids. Mark Mason from Center Point served 1986 to 1990. Patrick James from Urbana, 1979 to 1983. Patrick Zwanchek from Sola, 1969 to 1970. And David Shields, Cedar Rapids, 1964-1970 and 72-98. And led by Howard Purdy from here in Benton, uh, Rural Benton, 1958 to 1961 and Mike Smith were bound. Served from 84 to 1988.
remain standing and also retiring the flag tonight because we'll have the spotlight on. IPA member and now big shell builder, Nick Layton from Decora. Thanks, Nick, for playing taps. Our national anthem tonight was sung by Kristen Riley and Shelby Dawson, right, uh, and also as well by Jim, uh, Miss Blacker. Abby Blacker. Thanks, young ladies, for singing our national anthem for us.